I'm starting my YouTube journey this year in 2024, like for real. And these are the three things I'm going to be doing on my journey. The first thing that I'm going to be doing is setting a consistent weekly schedule for myself so that I am continuously uploading videos and I am going to continuously have topics at the top of my mind. So I kind of took a bunch of different creators ideas and I melted them down and created my own content creation process in Notion for my YouTube videos and so that I can really set myself up for success in terms of consistently posting. I have been in some way, shape or form trying to post on YouTube for the last three years and I'm taking that idea and I'm taking that word of trying to post on video and I'm tossing it out the window. I'm starting my YouTube journey and I am going to make it happen. The first part of that includes consistent videos. The second part of that is my head, my mindset, my frame of mind. You already heard me say it once. For the last three years, I've been trying. We're going to take that idea and that concept and just throw it out in the trash. It is going to burn in a dumpster fire <laughs> because in 2024, I am going to make this happen, which means that I'm going to have consistent topic ideas. I'm going to do consistent searches. I'm going to look and see it, topics that I can speak to with my own experience that I can create videos on for my YouTube channel and for my audience members. And that requires me to have the frame of mind where I am actively doing those actions and those tasks and those things. I have taken the step already to hire somebody as a assistant to help me with my thumbnails, to help me with my descriptions, to help me with my tags and my SEO. And they're also helped, helping me with my podcast notes too. So it really kind of works out. But when you're going into something with the frame of mind of like trying, you're setting yourself up to try. You're not setting yourself up for success. If you want to set yourself up for success, you want to go in with the idea that it is going to happen and that is a non-negotiable. And so this year in 2024, my YouTube channel is going to grow and it is going to start generating me money. That is a non-negotiable. I am going to make that happen. And so it really kind of, it not just only plays into the first point there of having a structured layout for myself so that I can create content and I can consistently upload, but it even goes in further into myself where I'm going in with the frame of mind of I'm doing this, I'm taking the action, I'm committing to this. And that's what's going to make the difference when I show up on camera, because you're going to see that energy come across and you're going to be like, wow, she's right. So that second point, it might seem like it's nothing, but it's actually so much of it. And a lot of the time, people think that the mindset stuff is like the last thing to work on. And oftentimes, it is the mindset stuff that we need to work on most. So that's the second big thing that I'm going to be working on when I start my YouTube channel. And even now, I'm saying it to you because I am actively making myself accountable and aware to the fact that that I am going to start this YouTube journey and I am going to make it work the way that I envision for it to work. The third thing that I am going to be doing in my YouTube journey is opening up. Like opening up in the sense that I'm going to be showing more of my life, showing more of my stories. Of course, yes, I'm still going to do these educational talking head strategic type of videos, but I'm also going to open up in terms of showing you what my day-to-day, -day, I'm gonna document my life, what my day-to-day -day life consists of, documenting my day, going through and really sharing with you the life and like my current state and really allowing for you to see the vulnerable me because even though I have all of these stories and all of these things have happened and all of these like amazing educational valuable things have come out of it, what has even 
more importantly come out of it is me and what I've been doing and what I've been able to do in terms of like moving out of my parents' house and starting a family and doing some really incredible things like paying off a shitload of debt. So I'm going to be opening up a lot more in the shorter form videos like my YouTube shorts and there may be the occasional long form video that's a vlog style video. You might see me in the car, you might see me traveling and I want to capture that because I want you to see and I want to also open it up to you that there's like so much more than just these educational talking head videos. So that's going to be how I go about my 2024 YouTube journey. Honestly, I haven't really watched that many videos. And when I say that many, I actually kind of click through one video that was like, if I was to start my YouTube channel in 2024, here's what I would do through and I was, I didn't even watch it. I don't even remember what that YouTube creator was saying in all honesty. All I know is that I'm committing to it this year. And maybe that's going to look like between now and the end of the year, a couple hundred videos. Maybe that's going to look like between now and the end of the year, an entirely different notion board. Maybe what that's going to look like between now and the end of the year is a huge community and my channel to start to monetize itself. But in any case, the only thing that's going to get me there is inspired action. I can sit here and I could think of it and I can manifest it all day long. But if I don't take the inspired action to get to that point, then I'm never actually going to see it happen. So I'm really excited to see what happens come December 31st of 2024, because this is something that's been like seven years in the making for me. And I actually want to see it come to fruition. So I'm really excited. And if you're new here and you love content creation, you love marketing, you love business, you love self-discovery and manifestation, be sure to subscribe because we're going to be talking about all of those topics here and also turn on notifications so that you know the next time that I put out a video. Thank you for tuning into this video. If you know which one of these topics you're like, I'm doing that this year, let me know down in the comments. Let me know what's been going on in your own content creation journey on YouTube down in the comments and share this video with a friend if you were like, this is so different from any YouTube creator I've ever heard talk about content creation because I guarantee you, because I've had more than five years of experience creating content, having other different social platforms go viral and having tried to create a business, there are going to be like really cute little nuggets of gold that are going to be scattered throughout all of my videos that are going to be different than a lot of other creators and that you're going to be like wow that that needs to get sent to someone so so i will see you in the next video thanks for tuning in okay bye